up? Welcome back to Kung Fu Maintenance. Today I'm going to show you how to change a Vexar, it's a York mobile home air filter. Uh, change air filters for this air handler. Now this is on a mobile home, but these are found in traditional homes as well. So it's a right. Vexar air handler. How to change air and Welcome to Kung Fu Maintenance. Today I'm going to show you how to change a York Vexar mobile home air conditioning filter. And this actually has two filters in it, um, but you know, yours may be slightly different. But what you've got down here around the side, you can hardly see it here, but there's a couple handles here. This handle, what you're going to do is pull right from that handle. So I'm going to show you here. Yeah, this is a Vexor York uh, International Air Handler. So you're going to pull one side and then the other. Now mine um, is a little bit tricky because I don't have much room here, but just knowing that that's where your clip is can allow, there we go, let's pull and pull there the clip and that's our air filter assembly and there's our air filters. Now this takes two 16 by 20 by 1 air filters and you just slide them out from the top. It's really easy and you just want to watch for your airflow direction yeah. so here's our top filter and as you can see the arrow is going this way so we're coming in we're coming in through the grill that way and so we're just going to mimic that so we've got two new filters here and again, these are 16 by 20 by 1 air filters. Now, if, if you have al allergies or sensitivities, you may want to consider a what's called a HEPA filter. It's a high-efficiency particle arrester. Okay. So, anyway, I'm going to pull out my second filter. And this one, actually, we'll pull it from the bottom. Just like so. So one in the top and one in the bottom and we're there. You can go either way. You can slide it all the way down. But once again, you're going to want to get your arrow the correct direction. Get our filter started. Push it on down. Into place. Okay. And then from the bottom, we'll do the same thing. You can just flip this upside down. That'll make it easier. And we'll feed our filter on in. And again, the same thing. Going to want to make sure our arrow is going in the correct direction. There we go. Slide it on in, all the way, and we're good. And I just want to unbend the filter there. There we go. And now it's set up properly, so we can flip it back over. And now you can see those clips that I was telling you about right there. Those are going to press into the holders right here. Okay. So, our bottom deal just rests its feet into the deal. And it has two clips. So now I'm clipped in there. And now our top deal is going to insert into these top parts. And the bottom deal will clip in. As well as these two slots here on the top, these two grooves, are going to go into the slots. right here and that's really going to be the first part of this so we're going to insert those up and into the two slots just like so and at the bottom we're going to rotate and push it on in and sometimes you kind of have to pull the bottom one out line it up with it and kind of do them both at the same time just like that 
and we'll push it into its holders and we're good to go. Now our air filters are all set. This bottom one looks like I gotta move it over a little bit. There it is. Alright. We are good to go. Ready to run the air conditioner. Anyway, that's uh, replacing a mobile home air filter for a York air handler. Thanks for watching Kung Fu Maintenance over out. Again, uh, if uh, you have allergies or sensitivities, you might consider a HEPA filter. Uh, this filter, uh, these filters uh, do let smaller micron uh, particles through and the uh, HEPA filter can help arrest those. So they are more expensive and you have to change them more often and all that. But anyway, that's changing the air filters on the York Air Handler Vexar for a mobile home for your heater or your air conditioner. You can get all your air filters and as well as other items you might need through my website where I make a small commission on anything you order.